Hi guys, what's up? My name is Chris and today we're going to take a look how to fix the uh, MDM could not write to a new authorization entry disk possible out of disk space. Error, no space left on disk. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. <laughs> Alright guys, so let's jump right into this. Um, on my one of my Linux machine, I'm getting this error. So let's jump into it and let's see what we can how to fix it. So this is the error I'm getting. The uh, MDM could not write to a new authorization entry to disk. Possible out of disk space. Error, no space left on um, device. So from here now, this is a Linux machine, a Linux Mint machine, and I'm getting this error. So this happens when you boot up the computer. So I'm going to go ahead and just hit OK to that. And then I get this following error, could not start X server, the graphical environment, due to internal error. Please contact your system administrator or check the syslog and, di and diagnose. In the meantime, this will display will be disabled. Please restart the MDM when the problem is corrected. So from here now, I'm going to hit OK again, and it takes me into the client. So I'm going to go ahead and just log in. You you know if you have this problem, just use the username and password that you you use no, to normally log in. Okay, I'm now log, logged in. So to do this is very, very simple. All we got to do is run sudo app-get clean. Um, I'm not sure exactly what's happening there. There's something going on there, so I don't know what's happening. But by running this command, it's obviously missed, it's doing some sort of clean on the system and it's allowing us to then boot it into the graphical user interface. So let's go run this command then. So to do this, I'm going to go sudo app-get, then clean. So take a look at that command. So it's sudo space apt-get space, then clean. I'm going to hit enter. It's going to ask for, the, uh, for my password. So I'm going to go ahead and type in the password. Obviously, you've got to be an administrator to, in order to run sudo. So, hit enter. That's that completed. Now, I'm going to go sudo reboot just to reboot your computer. I'm going to hit enter. It's going to restart. And there you go. So we now can log in. And there you go. So that's how you can fix that error. Um, I hope this helped you. And thanks for watching.